Hi there, welcome to How to D&D. My name's Frederick Weller and today I'm going to show and demonstrate the D&D or Dungeons and Dragons names generator for Android. You can put it on a phone, you can put it on a tablet, as long as it's Android. It is not available on iPhone unfortunately. I have the D&D names generator on my phone but I also have it on my tablet. I'm going to show this demonstration on my tablet because it'll be bigger. This is the one app as a dungeon master I use the most. It is free, I don't have to pay for it. It has the ability to create names for different races and it's keyed in so that each race is very, very specific. So I can have a name for a drow, a dragonborn, a dwarf, an elf, a gnome, goblins, uh, goliaths, halflings, half elf, half orc, humans, orcs, tieflings. So in this case, let's select human. I can then select whether I want it to be male or female. Let's go with female. And then I just press the create button and it creates a name. And I just press it again until I pick a name or see a name that I like. If I like that name, I can then press the plus, which then saves it. Okay. I can only save two names with the free version. If you get the pay version, you can have an unlimited number of names saved. Uh, one of the great things about this particular app is that if you select a race, uh, such as the elf, and then press the button to create a name, it not only gives you a name, it gives you the meaning of the name. So it breaks it up in brackets and divides it up, and that's kind of really helpful. If you get the pay version, which is about a dollar and 33 cents, then you get no ads. You can see I've got ads on the screen. Uh, and you have 24 races rather than the limitations that the free version has. Uh, you can also save as many names as you like. I can write, right now I've only got one name saved. Um, I highly recommend this particular piece of software. I use it more than anything else. What I find really useful is the fact that the app is available on, on the phone. And because I can carry a phone with me in just my pocket, uh, which is certainly going to take up less space than a tablet or a laptop. Um, I can pull it out. I always have my phone on me, but I can forget to bring my tablet. So that's the good thing about having it on the phone. I've never really been a fan of cell phones. I just don't like being contacted constantly uh, at any time, any place, anywhere. I just don't want to be that available. But um, a cell phone is a very useful tool to a dungeon master and I use the D&D Names Generator constantly in my games. I highly recommend this app. If you found this video helpful and informative, please share, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. Make a comment below. Um, tell me, have you used this app before? What did you think of it? Is there something else that you use? I know you can use the chart on the Dungeon Master screen. But I just don't seem to use it. I keep coming up with names that I don't really like. So I don't use it. I use my phone instead. And until next time. Keep rolling those 20s.